Welcome back to another vlog. So I am in the car again. I always seem to end up in the car for whatever reason that might be. Um, today is my braces update. So I posted a braces like video when I first got them. Um, oh my gosh, that was like quite a while ago now. Anyway, I've got my orthodontist appointment this morning. It's at 9.55. It's currently eight o'clock so i've got another like 45 minutes before i need to set off however we're going to drive to doncaster so um it's going to take about an hour to get to doncaster and then i'll give you like my update proper obviously once i get my braces um tighten and stuff but at the moment this is probably not the best lighting shaving but i literally i just got a gap so I've got a gap in like the bottom, middle of my teeth. Um, the top are pretty much straight to be honest. I hope that it's so not flattering angles. Um, but yeah, I've literally just got, it's not flattering angle either. I've got somebody parking next to me, this is lovely. I'm just gonna wait for this person. I've got my orthodontist appointment at 9.55 and then I'll see from there what we're going to do because I haven't planned out food or anything like that. It's my first day off. I've booked it as a holiday day today um, just because of the fact that I needed it for my orthodontist appointment. And I've not planned out food because I was waiting to see how much my teeth are going to hurt afterwards. Most of the time, more recently, my teeth aren't hurting after my appointments purely because we're not really doing an awful lot. Oh, the sun's come out. That's not a flattering angle in the slightest. If the sun could just go away, that would be lovely. Oh, no, my face is blocked off. So it's, got, it's gone behind a cloud. That's much better lighting. So, yeah, I've got my outfit on this appointment at 9.55 and it's just going to be a tightening appointment, I think. So, at the, mo at the moment, I just have the gap at the bottom um, that needs closing. Once that's closed, I feel like I'm not going to be far off needing my braces to take off. So I've not had them on for that long. I want to see when I posted my braces video. YouTube. I don't even think what I was searching for then. So that was it was a year ago i feel like it was in january that i posted that i just can't see youtube just didn't tell me when it actually was so it was a year ago but i feel like it was in the january that i got my... it must have been in the january because that's when i got my braces on so it's been a year and a couple of months so i'm hoping only like another few months and then my braces will actually just come off altogether i'm pretty happy with where my teeth are in regards to like the straightening because my teeth i will like insert clips and stuff my teeth were so bad before really crooked and um, really overcrowded so they removed one of like my teeth that was sat slightly behind the rest of them and um, they removed that had a massive gap i'm talking like a good centimeter gap and that was for over christmas and everything i had to have that gap because they both pushed my brace appointment back so i ended up getting my tooth removed a good like nearly two months before i actually got my braces so that was lovely and since then obviously my teeth have changed a lot so i'm really happy with the progress that i've had and um, with my teeth the only thing is i so i know it sounds so deft i don't like the shape of my teeth in terms of like the top of them i don't like the little ridge ridges in my teeth so i might look at maybe getting them filed maybe getting a bit of composite bonding at some point but that would be for a long time to check but once i've been to my orthodontist appointment i'll see about food because then i'm going to be hungry by that point because it's eight o'clock and i'm already hungry and i'm going to have to wait until after like i'm gonna have to wait till like nearly 11 o'clock for food i've also got a coaching um like meeting uh with i think it's like over a call with a girl that i found on tiktok who literally is like she's insane like fitness wise she's literally like amazing she lifts so heavy and everything like that like it is ridiculous so i'm hoping that she's going to be able to give me a lot of tips and stuff because i started the gym on monday we're on thursday now so i've been twice this week um i'm wanting to go again today if i've got the time to so i know that's such a like if i've got time to i'm really hoping just to get to the gym again today i need to come back to hull and then go after so i'm like in three different places today 
but I'm gonna see my mum also in Scunthorpe. I'm also gonna see my sister and her baby because my, I've got my nephew now and he's literally the cutest thing ever. So I've only met him once and he's just over a week old. So the second time going to see him because they're an hour away, it's quite difficult to pop all the time and see them. So it'll be nice to see them today. And I also want to go to Primark as well because I've seen they've got quite a few good bits in at the minute and I've not really got any staples like what i'm wearing today is literally my favorite outfit ever i've just not got enough dressed and stuff and like i need to obviously mix it up but i just don't want to be wearing the same blazer all the time i have got one other blazer um but in terms of, like dresses tops i've not really got many staples i've just got a lot of like jumpers um a couple of pairs of jeans gym clothes that's pretty much it so I've, i need to get some more bits and bobs that are like staple pieces graphic tees is something i'm massively into at the minute i love a graphic tee with some jeans a graphic tee when i go to the gym that is literally like my go-to i'm hoping that i can use the cable machine today at the gym because i went last night i did arms and back last night however there was literally like no space on the cable machine for me to use that and that was one of the things i went specifically to use so i do need to get a bit more comfortable with using other stuff as well however i literally planned a workout around the cable machine and then couldn't do it so i had to sort of just like wait for other bits that i had saved that i wanted to do but i'm not i don't really know if i'm feeling it as much today um as or what i wanted to like i literally from monday's session I left the gym and was in like my legs were in pain and then after the gym literally up until yesterday my thighs were so sore to the point where i was struggling to walk i was struggling to like sit down and get back up again like it was a really good like intense session and i really want another session like that so i feel like because i'm not feeling it in my back and stuff today I want to go a little bit harder like push myself a bit more with it because i started off quite light just for the simple thing of i didn't want to overdo it but now i know that i've not done it quite as much as i wanted to so i might just do the same as what i did last night again today just with heavier weights or try and get on the cable machine or both to be honest I might even try to do, do both that'll be good got another like 40 minutes basically until i can set off which is so annoying because i'm just gonna be sat here and i know i'm hungry already which is just ridiculous but i don't want to eat anything before the orthodontist because that is just not gonna be not gonna be pleasant so i'll give you an update once i've finished at the orthodontist and i'll have my coach and think at like 10 half 10 i've got that at, so i'll probably only be in the orthodontist till like 10 i'm there at 9:55, and i know i'll probably be out there by 10. it started snowing again it's literally like the, we're at the end of March. Why is it snowing? I have no idea. Um, but I've had my braces re um, tightened. So they put power chains on the bottom to close up that middle gap, and then they'll just put normal links on the top to keep closing them. So we basically they just tightened them a bit more. Um, I feel quite tight, sort of at the back, obviously to try and close that front gap a little bit more so yeah not really too much to update you on to be honest really on the braces side of things but i've literally been down for a week and i got you half an hour early so i've been down for a week for like 40 minutes now i've got that call at half 10 so i feel like i'm gonna have to go find like a tesco or something that i can just run in and maybe even get something to eat i'm literally need a wee so badly but my offer don't is to like in and out at the minute like the appointments are not i was there for like my appointment was at five two bearing in mind it's 57 minutes past like you're, you're in and out there's no no messing about so yeah it's a sorry about this lighting um yeah it's a bit bit difficult to try and go to the toilet in there because they are literally like wanting to get you in and out in two seconds but it's one of those yeah let's pop to a tesco or something get some food because i'm hungry i just can't believe this snow like i'm gonna show you now the windscreen's dirty because it's been snowing whilst i've been in there but what is going on man i was looking i was like where is that tree you probably can't see it that well but it is definitely snowing and this is so this is what my teeth look like at the minute I just got that gap there. And once that gap is closed up, that will be my braces, like, will be at a good point then. So yeah, I'm gonna 
pop to Tesco, like I keep saying, or like an answer to all, some kind of supermarket and get some food and go for a week.